everybody, it's Miss Kibble and welcome back to another Tutorial Tuesday and today what we will be doing is something have to do with this house over here. But last week we did make a automatic wheat farm system that does work beautifully. So you just go ahead and press that and everything just you now right into the bottom. So yeah. Today we will be working on this house over here, and you might have just saw what I was making over there in the back, but that is okay. Uh, we're just gonna throw that seat over there. Hopefully it'll go in. And turn the water off, and there you go. You got all your stuff. And as you remember, I did make this in, in one of the videos. As you can see, it does work perfectly, perfectly still. So yeah, go check out that tutorial. And why are these cows still jumping? Didn't I turn it off? Sorry. There we go. Now they're all off. Okay. So you know. You just come home and your kids are out playing in the back. Just say your Minecraft kids or whatever. And you know, you're a little bit hungry and you know, you got some food in the fridge and it's not cooked or anything. So, you know, you just get whatever you want. You got a chicken and a rabbit. And you know, ooh, I got this nice grill back here. You know, let's just cook it up real quick. Ah, you know, we need some, we need a little bit of music going, so let's get some music going. Ah, nice cooked chicken. Yum. You know, you can just come out here, sit while your kids play, and yum, yum. You know, you talk to your wife, yum, yum, yum. <laughs> but anyway, today we will be making this awesome grill here, and I do have to give credit to, um, FedEx gave me for this tutorial. I just thought it was awesome, so I did want to make it. And it was fairly simple because I did not have an idea for this week, and I am sorry for that. But I do have an idea for next week, which should also be it's similar to this grill, but it goes inside the house. But it is gonna be pretty cool. Um, so it's really easy to make. All you have to do is come down here and yeah, let's basically do this. And this rabbit took forever. You know, we can just put some other stuff in there. But yeah, this is basically all the redstone that you need right here. So, what we're going to do is, I'm not going to make it to the house because that took me about 15 minutes. So, we're just going to save the game real quick because I realized that I did not save this before I um, started. So, we're going to save auto save real quick and we're going to get started. So, really all you need is, well, first off, first, 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 first and foremost, grab you some yellow hardened clay or whatever you, you are using. Any walk works except grass because you need to see where you are making. So you need to grab hoppers, you need to grab droppers, hopper dropper, got it. Uh, if you have a furnace, furnace, uh, grab some chests as well, there we go. And then what you want to do is you want to go where you want to place your, uh, your uh, grill and you want to place two blocks. Now what you want to do is mine down four blocks, so that is one, two, three, four, then one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, four, three, four, and then that is it, and then you want to also mine out underneath as well. Am I correct on this hole? Let me go check real quick. So it goes one, two, three, four, five. No, I missed the side. Okay, so we need to mine out the side one more, I believe. Four, yes. Like that. And then we need to go ahead and mine out this back side right here. Only by two. And then we can get started with what we need to do for this part of the video. Okay. So I had to go make sure what I did. Okay. So what you want to do is off this block, place that. And then what you want to do is from this block here, place a hopper going into this furnace. Like that. Then what you want to do is place three I mean three droppers going up, so you're gonna have to crouch two three. And then what you want to do is place a hopper going into this dispenser, dispenser this furnace here. So what you're gonna do is you can mine this block here, place a chest right here. And the only reason why I told you to mine that block is because you cannot open the chest with that being on top of it. So you're gonna leave that block off. And what you want to do is have 
your um, have another hopper going into that like that. So that you can put your coal in this chest here. Give me one second. So for this tutorial, I will be using coal blocks just to make it easier on my life. And you just fill them all in, and it'll start eating all, everything out and pushing it into the uh, furnace here. So what I would do is literally grab an entire, well, get an entire chest full of coal, coal blocks, uh, charcoal, whatever you want to use. Make sure the hopper's full as well, so you don't have to come back to this anytime soon. Okay. <coughs> so on to the next part. So what this does is uh, this will be a hopper here, and it will push into um, this thingy here, which then push into the furnace here, which then whenever the uh, the food's done cooking, it will push into here. Now, right now, it only stays in there; it does not go up. So we what we need to do is make this thing go up onto the next one. So what you would want to do is grab a repeater, a redstone block a redstone repeater and a block of your choice and for now I'm going to use some blue hardened clay. Now I have to go back and remember how I did this. Okay. Alright, it's okay. It's a hole. There it is. Okay. So what you want to do is place a repeater going out like that. Then place a block like that. Come right here, place a redstone dust there. Place a repeater there, which then if you place a, um, wait, I messed up, I think. What? No, I didn't. Okay. Oh, yes, I did. I forgot to place a block in front of it because that makes the signal cut off. Okay. So, place a block here. Now, if you try to do it, it will shoot it up to this one. Now, we need this one here to shoot up to the next one. As you can see, it does not shoot up there. So what we need to do is come right here. Oh, no. Don't place that in. Come right here. Place, well, mine out this block here as well. You want to place a redstone dust here, a repeater here on two ticks, then a block here and a redstone block, a redstone there. So now if we place a redstone in there, that will shoot up and it'll go up out like that. Perfect. So that is really it. I believe and I believe you need to add a chest right after the droppers yes you do okay so go ahead grab your chest real quick and then go ahead and place it down on top of this like that okay perfect so then what you want to do is grab another hopper and place it going into that hopper right there so that it goes down like that okay so then what you want to do is you need to go ahead and grab your rails and a a uh, minecart with the hopper inside of it. Then what you need to do is you don't really need to clear out a big space as I am, but you can go ahead and do that if you want. Just take everything out of your inventory that you don't need. Grab a piston and a redstone block or a lever, whatever, or a button. Anything works. Then what you want to do is you want to um, grab your dirt because that's what usually goes around a grill and I would place that in right now if I was if I were you it's like that then go ahead and place in your block right there place a rail on top of it and make sure it is facing out that way not going straight place a the minecart with the hopper on it mine it and then it'll be pushed right there so what you want to do is make this block right here go into it so that it pushes it into uh well this block will be pushed into the minecart so then what you need to do is get out of crash mode place a piston going into that block like that and then place like that perfect so then you can go ahead and fill in this in and then what you want to do is you want to grab now well actually you're pretty much done so <laughs> you can go ahead and fill in this entire thing. You no longer need it. If I were you, just so that no mobs, if you're playing on hard or easy or anything, place a torch down here so that no mobs spawn in. Then cover that up. Perfect. I mean, well, yeah, still cover that up. And then grab your black hardened clay. Place it on top like that. And then what you want to do 
is go ahead and grab two stone slabs boom and boom like that and then go ahead and grab a trap door place one here like a little burner and then place come on the back side and place one in like that and place two in like that so then what you want to do is go ahead and grab a banner real quick and then place it off the side like it's a little towel that people use uh, to wipe their hands off with the grease and stuff um, then what you want to do is go ahead and grab um, your stone or whatever um, whatever you want to use to make your um, the back part of your grill out of so then go ahead and put those down put those upside down stairs there then you can go ahead grab your iron trap doors grab a item frame and you can use iron trap doors still or you can use um, either light stain light light stain oh my god I cannot talk you can either grab light gray carpet or you can grab gray carpet and for this I'm going to use light gray carpet so go ahead place those there now this is what the uh, door would look like if you placed in the uh, iron trap doors this would be like the little door handles to go into your propane tank and stuff or what you can do is use the carpet and place those in like that like that for little door handles make this go back right there so then you can also go ahead and go on top place your iron trap doors and there you go there is your working grill so go ahead you can grab however much food you want and go ahead just throw it right in front of it and it should be cooked in about a couple seconds so just give it a second and waiting 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 ever so patiently um my food oh I forgot to tell you once you mine the uh the block underneath the uh hopper cart make sure that your rail is not in your furnace and then you can cook your food what a retard there you go so the, now you have a completely working grill as you can see here now you have your cooked chicken and there's your working grill so you know what we're gonna turn this to night real quick and we're going to you know just have a nice peaceful dinner so you know you come right here looks beautiful you're walking home after a long night and I mean a long day at work you see your kids are playing in the backyard and you know, your wife's sitting out watching them, and you know what, let's let me get some food, you know, let's go cook it for us to eat. So, instead of go sleeping in your nice little dog bed over there, come back here, you know, just casually throw your raw mud in at the thing, you know, grab a CD that you want to play, go with Chirp, and, you know, play it. And you now kind of sit here for a couple seconds, talk to her, and then bing, food's ready. Let's go get the food. The rest of it should be done in just a second. There we go. So, you know, yo, honey, here's your food. But, you know, I'm single on Valentine's Day. <laughs> but, anyway, guys. That is it for the grill tutorial. Um, today, I mean, tomorrow, I will have a Thanksgiving special on Kibble's Adventure for you guys to uh, watch. I know it, I should have done it today since it is Valentine's Day, but um, I it's Tuesday and I upload a tutorial on Tuesday, so that's what I did. Uh, but yeah, happy, val how, oh, happy Valentine's Day to everybody. Hope you're all having a good Valentine's Day. Uh, if you have a girlfriend, I hope you're treating her very well. Um, but sadly, single and ready to mingle, you know, hit me up in the DMs if you want. No, I'm kidding. Uh, but anyway, guys, I'll catch you all tomorrow with a Valentine's special. <laughs>